Living alone is an amazing experience, but even though it is amazing, sometimes you will find yourself feeling lonely. Here are three tips on what to do when you are feeling lonely. Hi, I'm Judy. Welcome or welcome back. If you're new to this channel, don't forget to subscribe. I post videos every week. So, when you are feeling lonely, it's very, very, very easy to, to go into this frenzy. So, I actually am going to ask you to stop right there, take a step back and think that the truth is that you are not alone. Let me tell you a story. Uh, one day I was on the phone and I was feeling very, 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 very low. So I was talking to my mom and I said this thing, and I, I think it was the funniest thing ever. It's like, Mama, nobody loves me. As you can imagine, she was not really impressed. And her sarcastic response was, well, I guess my new name is nobody. Come on, with very, very, very few exceptions, we all have someone in our lives that loves us. So my first tip is reach to the ones that you love and that you know they love you back. And what I mean by that, did I want you to reach out and tell them how lonely you are? Uh-uh. I want you to reach out and ask how they are doing. You know, you have your family, your siblings, what I call our chosen family, which is our friends. People that we choose to have in our lives for a reason. And I think it's very important to reach out to them. And as I said before, not to tell them how shitty you're feeling. You can do that if you want to, but to reconnect with our emotions. It's just, how are you doing? How was your day? Are you feeling okay today? Because sometimes you realize that together, you're stronger. Oh, if you don't feel like doing that, I get it. Sometimes when we're very, very low, it's difficult to do it. But if you can't do that, my second tip, focus on progress. I said it once and I'll say it a thousand times. Progress is the only thing that can change your mindset. Why? Because when you're doing good things for yourself, your confidence goes up, your self growth your self-worth, it starts to increase and we're going to places that we haven't been before. And what I'm saying by that is not like you have to stop doing whatever it is that you're doing and decide that today you're going to run a marathon. Maybe you can't. But you can take a shower, put up your makeup, if you want to, if you're a guy and don't want to use makeup, put up your fancy shirt. Get outside, enjoy the day, and just focus on doing something positive. Buying milk counts. Mm, going to the gym, uh, walking through the park, anything that makes you feel like you have accomplished, even if it's a little bit today. And that takes me to tip number three. Dedicate the day to yourself. I know what you're going to say, oh Judy, I'm not that important, blah, blah, blah. I don't care. When you dedicate the time, day to yourself, to the things that you really want to do, you tell your mind that you are important. And who is going to be more important to you than you? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Think about it. You know, I pride myself on being great company. But what kind of a company I am if I'm not great company to myself? So for me, a hot cocoa, a nice book, candles, and a little bit of ambience can actually change my mood. Because even though I am alone in my apartment or in that coffee place or whatever it is that I am, I'm not completely alone because I do have myself. And that makes me feel strong inside. I am great company, and even though it's difficult to understand right now that you're feeling low, you are great company to yourself too. Don't put yourself down. Remember you are important, and you are the most important person to yourself. So, what do you do when you're feeling lonely? How do you cope with it? Do you have any tricks 
that I haven't said that could be useful, leave it in the comments below. And you know how this goes. If you like this video, please make sure that you like it. Share it with your friends, comment, subscribe if you haven't already. And um, if not, I'll see you next week. Bye bye.